Hello everyone. Today I am going to explain about duality. What is mean by duality? I will tell you. I will explain. After that how to convert the given LPP, primal LPP into dual LPP also I will explain. Now given any LPP, given from a given any LPP, we can associate another LPP, we can bring another LPP with it. The given problem is called, then the given problem, given LPP is called primal LPP and a newly constructed problem is called dual LPP. From given LPP, we can associate another LPP called dual LPP. The given LPP will become primal LPP. Newly constructed problem is called a dual LPP. Now, in this one, if primal has n variables, n number of variables, if the given problem, given LPP has n variables are there and m constraints, n variables and m constraints, then the dual has m variables, just quite reverse, m variables and n constraints. And the primal and the dual are so related that we can get solution of the primal from the solution of dual. Now, these primal and dual are uh, relate, uh, so much related in such a way that from primal we can bring the solution of dual or from the <coughs> we can get the solution of primal from the solution of dual. After converting the dual uh, from the solution of dual we can bring the solution of primal also. Now, there are few rules for writing the dual of a primal. Now, use the given primal, given problem is primal LPP. From the primal LPP to write, to bring the dual LPP, there are few rules are there. What are the rules? I will tell you. Now, the first one is maximization of Z becomes in the given LPP, in the given primal means given LPP, primal LPP, given LPP is primal LPP. This is dual LPP. If the primal LPP is in the maximization Z, the dual LPP will become, in here the, in the dual it will become minimization of Z. In the, for example, in primal it is minimization of Z, in dual it will become maximization of W. That means if a primal is a maximization, a dual, in dual it will become minimization. In primal it is minimization, then it will become maximization. Now, the coefficient of the objective functions, coefficients of the objective function becomes constants. Constant means right side, right side of the right side values of the constraints. Coefficients of objective function become right side of the const constants and constants become coefficient of objective function, just quite reverse, will become like that. Now, n variables, n constraints, m constraints, m variables like that matrix <coughs> matrix of constraint coefficient a will become a transpose matrix of a constraint coefficient in constraint the coefficients of a will become a transpose while doing the problem i'll explain about this one now for example now he will see the first problem write the dual of the following lpp Always remember the given LPP is a primal LPP. We are writing the dual of the primal LPP. Now maximization of Z becomes solution. Dual LPP. Maximization of Z becomes minimization of W. Now see here the uh, right side of the constraints will become the coefficients. Now here we already in the in the primal LPP we already used x1, x2, x3 variables. That's why we will use y1, y2, y3. Again, if you write the same x1, x2, x3 in uh, dual also, we will get confused. That's why we will use another type of variables y1, y2, y3. Now see min uh, min w is equal to coefficient of uh, huh? 12, 12 y1 plus 20 y2 plus 18 y3 these three right side of the constraints will become the coefficient of objective function and now this the uh, coefficients of uh, the first one becomes the transpose see 3y1 plus y2 plus 2y3 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to coefficient of uh, 
coefficient of uh, x1 objective function whatever the objective function the values of objective function becomes right side of the constraints now the first one is uh, 1 uh, that's why greater than or equal to 1 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to now the first uh, 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 the first column will become first row second column will become second row third column coefficients will become third row now the second one is the second one is y1 plus 2y2 plus 5y3 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to the second con constant x2 coefficient is 2 now the first the coefficient of the first column coefficients will become first row coefficients the second column coefficients will become second row coefficients the third column coefficients will become third row coefficients all the less than or equal to symbol we will become greater than or equal to now maximization becomes minimization right side of the constraints become the, the coefficients of objective function and the coefficient of objective function will become right side of the constraints now third coefficients we will see the third column coefficients y1 plus 4 y2 plus uh, minus y3 minus y3 is greater than or equal to the third coefficient is 3 and all the y1 y2 y3 greater than or equal to 0 this is the dual LPP this is the dual LPP we will see another problem form a form the dual of the following primal problem primal LPP is given using this one we have to convert into the dual LPP now max, uh, ma maximization of Z becomes minimization of W now the right side of the constraints will become the coefficient of objective function 25 now here already x1 x2 x3 we used that's why y1 y2 y3 25 y1 plus 30 y2 plus 40 y3 now subject to the constraints the first column coefficients in the constraints the first column coefficients will become first row coefficients first column coefficients first column coefficients will become the first row coefficients 2y1 plus 4y2 plus 6y3 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to the coefficient of objective function will become the right side of the constants 4 now second 4y1 plus 9y2 plus 8y3 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to the coefficient of uh, x2 is uh, 10. Now 8y1 plus 8y2 plus 2y3 less than or equal to becomes greater than or equal to coefficient of x3 in objective function is 25 and y1 y2 y3 greater than or equal to 0 this is the dual LPP this is dual LPP dual LPP we will convert one problem into the dual LPP now in this problem minimization of z given therefore it will become maximization of w now y1 y2 y3 the right side of the constraints will become right side of the constraint will become objective function see 40 y1 plus 20 y2 plus 30 y3 subject to the constraints the coefficient of x1 first column the coefficient of first column will become the first row coefficients the first column coefficients will become first column 2y1 plus 20 y2 plus 4y3 greater than or equal to becomes less than or equal to now coefficient of x1 is in the objective function 20 now the second second column coefficients will become second row coefficients 20y1 plus 3y2 plus 15y3 
greater than or equal to be cancel less than or equal to coefficient of x2 is 40 y1 y2 y3 greater than or equal to 0.